an automobile traveling at 40 km per hour can be stopped at a distance 40 meters by applying brakes. If the same automobile is traveling at 80 km per hour, the minimum stopping distance in meters is. In this question, two cases are there. Initially, an automobile is traveling with a speed 40 km per hour. U is equals to 40 km per hour. The same automobile in another instant traveling with another speed that is 80 km per hour. Finally, in these two cases it comes to rest position. Final velocity is 0 in both the cases. In first case, the stopping distance is 40 meters. In second case, we have to find out the stopping distance. The common point in these two cases, in first case and second case, automobile is the same. So, the acceleration of the automobile is the same. Do one thing, take equations of motion. V square minus U square is equals to 2AS. Here also, V dash square minus U dash square is equals to 2AS dash. Final velocity is 0. Initial velocity is 40 km per hour. 2A into S is 40 meters. Here final velocity 0. Initial velocity is 80 km per hour. And we have to find out the distance. Take equation 1 by equation 2. Minus 40 whole square by minus 80 whole square is equals to 2a into 40 by 2a into s dash. Here 2a get cancelled minus also get cancelled. Once observe the conversions here this distance in meters and velocity in kilometer per hour but this is the ratio of the velocity so kilometer per hour kilometer per hour get cancelled. So no need to convert the units. 40 by 80 whole square, 41's, 42's. It becomes 1 by 2 whole square. Is equals to 40 by S dash. From this, S dash equals to 40 into 2 whole square becomes to 4. So, 40 into 4, that is equals to 160 meters. The minimum stopping distance is 160 meters. Third option is correct.